everyone. Hope your holidays, your Merry Christmas was good. So I am all done with mine. I happen to be headed back to Arizona. It is like the last few days of 2020. Uh, you know, I was driving up there and then it dawned on me. I had a friend who told me, hey, if you happen to be in New Mexico, can you go by Hatch and pick up some chili for me? This guy loves making all kinds of Mexican food. He's not Mexican, but he loves the food. And he loves the chili from Hatch. So, you know, I was driving up here and I thought, you know what? Why not? So it is like an hour detour from where I'm headed, but that's fine. This guy's great and, you know, I'll do it for anybody to be honest with you. But yeah, let's go get some Hatch chili. I know the place where to stop because I always stop there. But yeah, let's go to this place. Go. selection this place is like literally entering hatch new mexico and they have all kinds of um chilies and stuff this place right here is actually called uh, and i recommend it. i think it's called gill yeah there you go that's the name right there yeah it's a cool place stop by today happens to be a beautiful day and i'm on my way back to arizona but i had a friend who told me if you go by hatch of course, from where I live to Arizona, it's actually, it's a little detour. It's like an hour detour, but this guy's really awesome, so. So one of my favorite spots to stop by when I'm actually headed towards um, Arizona is at this Petro. And so the reason I like to stop at this Petro is because, you know, the pumps, they're easy to get in. If you're pulling a trailer, it's not difficult. They, they have clean bathrooms. But the number one reason why is because they have a Starbucks. Let me, let me explain something to you. Starbucks sometimes comes up mostly during the seasons with these, uh, you know, they'll have these, uh, like you could call them fruity drinks if you want to they're they're actually really good like they got pumpkin spice latte they have a uh peppermint mocha but yeah that's that's one of the main reasons why i like to stop here is because they have a starbucks and 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 i like it i'm not gonna lie i, I kind of like them <laughs> Today I happen to be driving Shelly. I nicknamed my dually Shelly. I'll explain later on a different video why, but yeah. You know, believe it or not, this truck gets amazing mileage, like about 17, 18 miles an hour. I mean, uh, a gallon. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's uh, it's amazing truck, man. When she doesn't have a trailer, man, this thing just hauls. And, um, and even when I put a trailer, man, you know, still pulling it like nothing so let's go inside and get one of these fruity drinks fruity drinks so at the store right now at this starbucks store they only allow seven people at a time. Being that it's a truck stop, sometimes it gets really full. But yeah, they only allow seven people at a time. So just got my peppermint mocha and I'm headed back to the truck. It should be done filling up and then we're on our way.
So almost back to the city I normally travel to in Arizona, but wanted to stop at this place and it's big boulders top of other boulders it's been cool i have passed by this place for year after year and you know i think this is probably one of the first time that i actually stop and climb up on these boulders you know you got i don't know less than five days left in 2020 and i've had a lot of time to think about a lot of things this year and if my life has been spared this this year i want to do things different I'm getting ready to write down some stuff like i normally do every year take the pen to the paper write down a vision make it plain but I want to do some things different on this upcoming year. I've realized so far my life has been spared. God's kept me healthy and safe. And I'm sure it's for a reason. I want to be able to help more people, impact more people, take what's given to me and use it for good. And I want to challenge you all to do the same thing. We got to stop hating on one another. There's no time for hating. Sometimes when I stop and I look at the hourglass full of sand that represents my life, I feel sometimes it's probably a little bit more gone than is left. So with that, I've realized that we got to just start loving one another a little bit more and taking care of one another and quit worrying about what color we are and what race we stand for and what country we come from. If we haven't learned anything in 2020, then I don't know what it's going to take for us to change. But I can tell you, 2021, I'm going to do some different things. I want to be able to reach a lot more people I want to be able to help a lot more people. And I want to enjoy my life. I want to enjoy my family more. I'm not going to say that I'm going to quit working as much as I do because it's part of my passion. It's who I am. But I will tell you this. I want you all to join me to be able to be better people and to not focus so much on things that are temporary. But for right now, I'm going to enjoy the sunset because it is beautiful. I wanted to share it with you guys. Check this out.